I can do things. <laughs> I can do things. There's a monument over there. Now, I don't want to be getting too close to those monuments. Because I don't want to be getting the mining fatigue. Immediately. So I don't want to be getting the mining fatigue now. I want to be getting the mining fatigue um, when I'm ready. I also don't want to be screaming. Because <laughs> that's going to happen. Because, man, the, 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 the getting the um, effects is so terrifying. The mining fatigue is so terrifying. I was actually doing a little bit of reading on the Elder Guardians, and apparently the um, the animation wasn't actually just me it wasn't meant to be terrifying. It was just meant to be something that symbolised when you had the effect. But because it comes out of the middle of nowhere, then yes, it is kind of a terrifying thing. <laughs> yeah, so interesting fact for you. Uh, right, so now it's daytime. <laughs> now it's daytime, I feel like I want to go underground and wait for night again. Which is very counterintuitive, because usually you want to be, be on the surface at day, and then you want to go underground at night. I am an idiot. Nighttime means phantoms, which means tomorrow night. Now, I don't know, does tomorrow night mean the phantoms come? Mean, meaning this episode's night. This is episode number... Uh, I, I have a timer in front of me for three hours. We've already done it for one hour. We'll use this pumpkin for seeds. Which means that we've just finished episode three. Which means this is episode four. Which means the phantom's coming out tonight. Crap. Okay, we are going to stay underground for even longer then. <laughs> okay, uh, do that. No, we don't. We want to do that. We want to do that. We want to do... One, two, three, four. Where's my pumpkin gone? Oh no, I've already made it into seeds. And we want to bone meal. Bone meal these one, two, one. There you go, so they now should be giving me. They've all reached their final stage, so now they should be giving me the. Um, their. Uh, pumpkins. When they finally are able to do it. Um, I actually don't need these turtles closed because the chickens can't get up there. The chickens are currently just loving the water, which is good. You may enjoy the water chickens. I will allow that. Look at this. Pumpkins galore. Oh, shit. How do pumpkins, like, grow? What's their sort of grow rate? Obviously, once they're fully grown here. I mean, uh, it seems to be working fine, so I don't really need to know it. It would just be nice to know, because stuff and things. So, let's head back underground. Uh. So, fun times. So I need three redstone blocks, which means I need 27 redstone. I have 19 already. Wow. And I'm sure I'll use gold for something. I'll figure out something to use gold for, because I can't use golden apples. What if I find a golden apple? Does that mean I can still use it? <laughs> Serious question. Unfortunately, you guys won't be able to tell me, because, well, this is all being recorded in one big chunk.
Uh, copper goes there, food goes there. Just some torches go there, I don't have any torches. I don't have any coal either. I have coal now. So there's, there's two levels that you... Um, well, whilst I'm in the strip mine, I might as well talk about strip mining. Because, well, <laughs> what else? So, when you're strip mining, apparently, well, there's about two levels you kind of want to be on. You want to be at Y12. Oh, actually, what a, whoopsies. Where are we at? We are at Y10. Which is good for just mining if you want no caves or anything. If you do want caves, you probably want to mine a little bit higher. Maybe around about 18, 20 maybe. Because then you'll still get, you'll still get the caves that slope downwards to get the... Um, to find lava and things like that. Because finding lava is good. As, as strange as that is. Finding lava is very good because you can... Because um, usually, where there's lava, there's often diamonds. And that's, that's actually a myth that diamonds spawn by the lava. Because, um, it's just because they, they naturally spawn on the same levels. Like, lava can spawn in big lakes from anywhere from Y12 downwards, and diamonds are the same, they spawn naturally from Y12 downwards. And because you're more likely to find, um, diamond veins in big caves, the same place you find lava lakes, then people think that uh, you find diamonds by lava lakes. Which is, of course, untrue. Whilst I was thinking, whilst I was thinking about myth busting, oopsies, because that was a, that was a um, Minecraft series I used to watch by Exumavoid. And basically he would take myths that the community had and prove or or bust them basically. Think of Miss Busters the TV show. That's what Exuma did for um for Minecraft. And so um so yeah, one of his episodes was dedicated to um obviously mini myths and stuff. Another one was actually about the sugar cane here. Oh, I have eggs in my inventory. Uh, on that hand. Um, one of them was actually about um, yeah, sugar cane and if it grows faster on sand. Because I, I always used to think that. I always used to think you had to place your sugar cane on sand because A, that's where I thought it was the only place it could spawn. What was I going to do up here? I can't remember. I can't remember what I was going to do up here. But yeah, I always used to think that you could only place your sugar cane on sand. Because that's... That's the only place you could put it. That's how it would grow. Anywhere else and it just wouldn't grow. And... And... Exuma tried this. Exuma tried um, putting it on sand. And tried putting it on every other sort of... Um, grass type. So he tried on the grass, he tried on dirt, he tried on coarse dirt, he tried on mycelium, he tried on uh, podzol, he tried on um, all that, all the other stuff. And to my surprise, oh, not only could you place it on the grass and the mycelium and the podzol and all that sort of stuff, but they grew at the same rate. <laughs> so, lo and behold, yeah, that was actually busted. And I was like, that's quite surprising. But I think it was for a time that you couldn't place sugarcane on grass. Because I'm trying to think, I, there was there was a reason I thought I thought that. It must have been because like you physically couldn't do it. I can't remember. Too long ago. <laughs> Sticks and a sword. There we go. Place the sword, and we'll also make 
a couple of chests. Because we make a chest, we have to make some trapdoors. Put the chest over here. We're not we're not going to um, bother about trying to automate e everything and things like that because it's too much hassle. <laughs> uh, no, do that. Please put them on. I now have a true space. So gunpowder thrown there, redstone thrown there. Actually, make the redstone into blocks. Um. Right, redstone goes there, sand and gunpowder go there. So, we're actually about halfway there for the gunpowder, which is good. And then I'll just throw some other stuff in the chest as well. Right, definitely need the food on me. No question, we need the food. Uh, what do I want to keep in that slot? I'm sure I'll put the bow there, put some arrows there. So, I was thinking, do I, do I reveal my plan now? No, I will not reveal my plan. I do have a plan on how to take out the monument. Is it going to fail? Probably. <laughs> this is this is me you were talking about. Um, I believe it is now night time. It is now night time. We shall go hunt some creepers. We shall go hunting some creepers. That was a cow. <laughs> Okay, hunt the creepers, hunt the creepers. And beware for screeching noises. If there if there are screeching noises, we just run. There's two creepers over there. Okay. Because my my plan relies so heavily on TNT, on creepers, then um. No, please. That backfired miserably. <laughs> yeah, because my plan focuses so heavily on creepers, actually it's very dangerous <laughs> trying to find, trying to get the stuff. Oh no, he's right beside our base as well. No. Yeah, awesome. Another one. I heard. Yep, I heard. I heard phantoms. Oh dear, here is one. Right, there's two. Boom. Right, there's two creepers up there as well, but... Okay, um... Think, Jam Cam, think. What do we do? 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 Um... Creepers don't despawn. Oh, uh, no, creepers do despawn. But they don't burn in daylight, so... Hopefully, we stay in here. When it becomes daytime, the phantoms are gonna burn. And the creepers are going to stay there. This is called using your head. Right, we are going to... Because... Okay, so creepers despawn with... Oh, anything despawns when they're 128 blocks away from you. Which means that... Um... Just trying to think. So we need to stay sort of near the surface and sort of around this sort of area. Because we don't want the creepers despawning. Right, we'll just, we'll just dig a hole here. We'll just get some cobblestone, because who knows when you need cobblestone. In fact, we even find iron. That's even better. Okay, so we're only going to be digging here at iron level, coal level and stuff, because, well, we kind of have to. <laughs> um, I guess my, my big problem is we can't get enchantments or anything. So, um... We can't get enchantments, so uh, yeah, we're just gonna have to go in with basic iron tools and 
diamonds if we're lucky, but I don't think we're going to be able to find any diamonds. Which is a shame. It's a real, sh it's a real shame. I reckon it's actually good that we can hear the phantoms from underground here. Because if we hear the phantoms, that means they're not despawning. See, I have some sort of logic. Uh, so... Gosh, my ears are really hurting. Hold on. Uh, my headphones are probably not the best for this, but... Oh well. <laughs> uh... This way a little bit more. Where are we? We're at Y58, so we're only a few layers under the dirt. Which is good because um, I think my microphone is slightly in the wrong place. Hopefully this changed it. Um, so I think that there is the is the dirt layer for the mobs, which is good because that means we're really close. We're just going to dig out our own cave, <laughs> basically. <laughs> I don't know why we're going to do this, we're just... Stuff it. I'm going to make a cave. It's going to be a fancy cave. Oh, those phantoms are... I cannot get over those phantoms, they're just... So scary. <laughs> Just done a loop de loop. A loop de loop? Yep, that's what we've done. Um Okay, let's just stay in here. Uh what was I going to do? I was going to Is that a phantom dying? No, that was not a phantom dying. Um I was going to do something, what was it? Gunpowder. Uh, craft, 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 boom. We're actually doing okay now for food, which is surprising, actually. actually no, I'm not, I'm not going to go near there, because <laughs> well, we, fa we found out what happened last time when I decided to take my phantoms. Didn't end very well for me, at least. Um, what's I going to do? Oh yes, that's right. Make another shield. This one's about to break. Can you combine shields? You can. There we go. I know that would technically repair the shield, but. Oh well. <laughs> uh, sugar. And. Well, I'm currently just sitting here waiting for the sun to rise, as it is doing now. So we're going to run out here now. See where the phantoms are. There's one over there. And one over there. So the sun is rising. There's a creeper right there. Where is he? He's over there. No, don't you dare explode. No! Ow. <sighs> Bother. Seriously, I was far away enough from that creeper. Okay. Um, another creeper over there. So I'm now coming up into, day into the bright daylight so I can not see any phantoms. That's good. Alright. Hello Creeper, would you like to drop some gunpowder for me? Yes, you would, thank you. 
right, we're up to 10. Because we have 8 back at the base, and we have 2 now. Which means we have t enough 2 TNT. Which isn't enough, sadly. But we need 3 TNT, because there's 3 uh, Guardians. Whoa, if I fell down there, oh. 